Let me show you how to unpair your Apple Watch with your existing iPhone, just in case you wanna get rid of your watch, sell your watch, or in this case, I wanna pair it with a brand new iPhone. So I wanna make sure it's unpaired from my existing iPhone. And in order to do that, all you need is the watch app on your phone, which comes installed already. Or if you just go to the app store and search for Apple Watch on your iPhone, you're gonna see the watch app and you could go ahead and open it from here. And the way you unpair it from your iPhone is you have to click this option right on top. It says all watches. Now over here, you should just see one watch. I just happened to have two watches because I was making another video about it, but usually you only have one watch available and you just have to press I over here. It's gonna show you everything about the watch and on the very bottom it says unpair Apple Watch. That's why you wanna select, press unpair again. In order to unpair it, you do have to actually type in your Apple account password. So make sure you have that and you type that in here. And then it's gonna take you to this page where it says unpairing Apple Watch. And this may take a few minutes. Now you'll see this dial here going around and as soon as this is complete, the unpairing is gonna be successful. You'll see the Apple logo on your watch and then you shouldn't have any watches. As I mentioned, I had another one, but typically you'll have nothing showing up here. Okay, now the process is done, it's been unpaired, but this is actually gonna back up this watch to iCloud. So then if you pair it with a new phone, you could do that, but it's gonna erase this watch completely and it's gonna be set up as a brand new watch once it's unpaired. And then on your new phone, you could just go ahead and add a watch by clicking this, or if you have a new phone, which I'll bring a new one over here to show you what happens. With a new phone, if I just unlock this phone and I open it up again, this pop-up is gonna appear over here. And if I go ahead and press continue, it's gonna actually help me set up the new Apple Watch and I could go ahead and set it up for myself. And I have a different video if you're trying to set up your Apple Watch with a brand new iPhone, I'll go ahead and link that video here. But right now your last Apple Watch has been completely unpaired and it's ready to go.